All right, what's up everyone? Duquesne23 here bringing you a new track called Star Wars Battle of Endor Racetrack. Um, as you tell right there, there's an ATST getting crushed by logs, um, kind of how it does in the movie. Uh, I have a bunch of jumps in this map. You know, it's on Ridgeline, which is a great map to forge racetracks on, especially with all the trees and there's a whole bunch of hills and everything. I love, uh, I love forging uh, this track on there just because provided me with tons of opportunities for jumps and stuff like this one right here some nice downsides some natural landings and stuff which are always my favorite uh, right here is an ATST with the main uh, little door you know to the complex I forget what it's called where the shield um, generator thing is uh, but right there is that I have a I know I have some speeder bikes in here. Right here is there's two different ways you can go. The top way, if you keep going full speed, uh, you will. It is a small shortcut, but it is difficult to keep going full speed. Uh, right here is two speeder bikes. Um, I know there's no people on them or there's no Ewoks on this map. You know, I tried making Ewoks with sandbags, but they turned out really big if you try to make them to where they have legs and arms and stuff. And they just didn't look too good. So I didn't worry about it. I also tried it with capture plates, but it still it didn't turn out good at all. So I didn't worry about putting them in there. But um, right there is a pretty big jump. Uh, that's the finish line or starting line, whichever part you're on in the race. Right here is another big jump through some rocks. Um, this was actually the very first thing I built on the on this map was that jump right there. Um, I didn't know exactly what I was going to do yet. Um, yeah, and watch out right there. Uh, make sure you go off of the center or else you'll hit a rock on the side like the guy I passed in the water did or you'll hit a branch like that guy at the very uh, first part of it did. But, um, you know, this is a really fun track. It's, you know, pretty competitive just because there's a lot of places where you can screw up. Uh, you know, it's a motocross track. I guess the style of it is more motocross. Um it's just really fun and it took me a little while uh, to make everything like all the aesthetics oh right there is an ATST uh, slipping on the logs like how it does in the movie and he falls over and stuff um, it's a really fun track uh, another thing that you know I forgot to say I started to say earlier was that whenever I first started making this track I really was kind of just going for a motocross track um, since Ridgeline looked like a very good motocross style um, track, like at least a map. And I just kind of started working on it. And then, you know, I already had an idea of doing an indoor, uh, a Battle of Indoor uh, style map. And I wasn't planning on doing it with this motocross one. But as I start, kept going through it, I didn't know kind of what aesthetics to put into the motocross, motocross track. So I decided, hey, just why not make it, you know, the Battle of Endor. Um, I know one person said, why isn't there, you know, who raced on it or uh, knew about it, said, why aren't there, you know, any like of the Ewoks uh, tree houses? But that's not in the movie where the battle actually is. So that's why there's no tree houses and stuff like that. But I hope all y'all liked it, you know, the map. Uh, please give it a download and like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks, everyone. This video is part of the Way Movement. We are YouTube. To learn more, visit TGN.TV.